did the orchestra evolve for the better? You may be curious on how the orchestra came about. Well, the orchestra is Greek in origin, an area where the Greeks danced and sang. Let's move on to how it evolved during its shift from the Baroque period. The orchestra was standardized during the Classical period by Haydn and Mozart. The Baroque orchestra consisted mostly of strings, its size ranging from 10 to 30 players having the strings and winds play the melody, while the woodwinds and brass play sustaining harmony. About the orchestra, I think the instrumentation of the orchestra. No, halimbawa, in the Baroque period, kina Vivaldi, parang string orchestra ng dati, violin, viola, cello, bass, tapos may harpsichord. Tapos, minsan may soloist sila, di ba? Concertino. O yun, tapos nung, ano, mayroon ng classical period na, ha, Kaya na dumadagdag ng mga instruments. May winds na, may, may brasses na, may melodies na. Actually, nung parang kasiyag, meron na rin. Ay, meron. Oo. I mean, diba may mga solo flip din, yung mga ano. Pero maliit lang. Madalas sa string orchestra, yung nag-accompany. Tapos yung may, may mga solo na sila. Flip. Ikolo. The first violins taking the melody, lower strings providing an accompaniment, woodwinds add contrasting tone colors, brass brought power to loud passages and filled with harmony, and percussions were used for rhythm and emphasis. Instruments were able to be played independently during the classical period. They were played according to the instrument's tone color. Winds and strings started to be melodically and rhythmically independent. Also, during the 18th century, the responsibility of leading the orchestra was given to the leader of the violins. This is due to the disappearance of the harpsichord. Having the strings play the most important melodic lines results in their becoming the backbone of the classical orchestra. The classical orchestra developed into a more flexible and colorful instrument wherein artists can show their true emotion through music. There was a, a trend in that period related to the kind of life that people used to live. You have Renaissance and modern and romantic, it's all related to how it developed. Other things happen around, and the music wasn't something uh, separate of all this movement or new ideas. They were all together. So in the romantic area, well, they need more instrument, they need more sound, they need all the things. So the development in the orchestra before was a baroque, was simple with a lot of ornament, yes, simple group, become bigger. They they started creating concertos, but the concerto was a question and answer, question and answer. And that's the developing to the concerto gospel, which is a soloist, and the, or the soloist says, I'm the orchestra to answer. And they always go back to the soloist, and the soloist back to the orchestra. It's just conversation with the instrument. Later on in the classical uh, era, the, because of the symphony, the classical orchestra is even um, much more uh, thicker in terms of uh, texture because it is joined now by, uh, in some cases, timpani or uh, some brass instruments, but mainly still uh, woodwinds. But this time, uh, not only the flute uh, is added, but also the clarinet and the basso. Having that said, do you think it evolved for the better or worse? <laughs>